outro cast. How much of your character is in Kassar the real person? Um, it's weird, much, but not much at the same time. I think, um, I think we're both funny. Well, I like to think I'm funny anyway. Um, oh. I think we both, <laughs> sure. I think we both use our, our facial expressions a lot. I think that's something I definitely brought to the character. I'm a very expressive person, so that just happened naturally. How long did you have to keep it a secret that you were going to be part of Dangerous Liaisons? Um, a few months, a few months. Um, but, you know, my family are not very secretive. So I told them and somehow my mom told half of East London. So it wasn't <laughs> really that much of a secret, but I, I tried. I tried my best. When you, when that was going on, did you tell them to use a code word? Like if you're going to talk about my TV show, refer yeah. to it as root beer, anything <laughs> like that. No, absolutely not, because my mom would definitely fail that mission. Um, so, no, I just let her do her thing. I just let her do her thing. <laughs> uh, when did filming wrap? Um, we finished in November the 14th, or something like that. Um, yeah, we finished in November. Wow, so 11 months ago that you've been kind of... You had to wait a couple of months to tell people that this was happening, aside from your family. Then you've been waiting for the show to come out. How do you deal with that kind of a suspense in real life? I mean, um, I think the people closest to you know, so that's like, that's fine. Um, I think apart from that, it's actually kind of nice because then people won't keep asking you about it. Um, and it's just like you get to just rest after that and chill out. Are there group threads amongst the cast members? That's that's how you know whether or not the cast got along. Yeah, absolutely. Um, me, Alice, and Nicholas have a group chat, and it's called Fishies, and we talk so much rubbish in our group chat, but I love it. It's the best thing. So there's Fishies. definitely a group chat. Yeah. It, yeah. It, so that's your nickname for each other, or the impetus of this relationship was fish? We just refer to each other as fishes, um, and I wish I could tell you why or how that happened, but it was a long nine months, and... Some weird shit happened, so fishies it is, you know? Yeah. Now, very, very general question here. Yeah. Highlight for you in filming these eight episodes. Is there a primary highlight or a series of highlights that you could reveal? Hmm. Wait, do you mean like on camera or like off camera? Like as in the character or just generally whilst filming it? Uh, generally for you, because for some people it is going to be the on camera and other people are going to go, well, I just found my best friends and mm. we're yeah. going on a text message thread together. So. Yeah, I think, no, of course, I think, you know, being friends with Nicholas and Alice is, is I'm just, yeah, very grateful. They're very beautiful humans. Um, and I think also just the whole experience was actually a highlight, no matter how hard it got. I think I learned a lot about myself and just grew a lot of integrity and um, learned a lot as an actor. So. It was a really nice experience, you know, in a way. I, w I wasn't able to tell from just watching, where was all of it filmed? In in the same spot or was it some of it studio and some of it street? Um, we were in Prague for nine months and I think we did like three scenes in studio, but the rest were just in actual real locations um, and in the streets. So that was really cool. Had you spent time in Prague before the shoot? No, first time. Wow. Okay. So yeah. you're going to somewhere where you have all the pressure of learning the lines and staying yeah. in character, yet I don't assume you speak the local language fluently. Absolutely not, no. You're getting used <laughs> to the food. Yes. So the food. I, I, oh, yeah, the food. Yeah, it's very different. It's Yeah, of course it's different. So yeah. I would imagine that all of you were drawn closer together because you were all experiencing so much new and pressure at the same time. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you, you're put in a new place naturally. You're going to, you know, get really tight with each other. Um, and that was nice. But I think, you know, some people love to do the, like Nicholas, he loved exploring. And he was like, he was always out. And somehow he made friends with the locals. It was just in secret spots. Whereas I am glued to my bed and will order food and watch TV. So, yeah, we're very different. But it was also very cute because we would all, you know, link up and do different things. Well, speaking of TV, down to my second to last question here. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Dangerous Liaisons is the best show on Stars. We all know that. Okay. It's, it's a fact. <laughs> but, but what's the second best show on Stars? Do you have any other favorites or recommendations from Stars? Um, I don't actually watch anything on Stars, but I have a friend who's obsessed with the show on Stars, P Valley, um, that I'm going to start like 
next week. So I haven't watched it, but I will recommend it because I heard it's incredible. So I'm going to say P Valley. <laughs> got to support those friends. And exactly. the last question I got for you, are you allowed to say what's next or is it all dangerous liaisons all the time? Uh, not dangerous liaisons all the time. I love it, but it's going to be, you know, some of the time. Um, but I love independent films and I want to go into writing and just doing more behind the scenes stuff. So just tap into that for a bit, you know? Oh, wow. Okay. So, so following up on that really quickly. So you are working on your next thing. We just are not allowed to know what it is just yet. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> I guess so, Darren. Well, thank you for your time. Looking forward to that next work of yours and congratulations on a job well done in this season one, hopefully the season of many to come. Thank you so much. I really appreciate talking to you. It was a lot of fun. Outrocast.